All right, hello everyone. This is that fractal equation. I showed it to you earlier on in this series. All right, and the reason why I've delayed in uploading this for so long is because I'm not happy with this camera's ability to show you this. I can't really show it to you in one picture. I'm gonna pull back and show it to you now so that you can see what you're looking at. And you're gonna see that you're basically looking at the shape of a square. But I want you to kind of see how this thing resembles a spider's web. And then I'm going to go ahead and read this scripture right here for you that is going to pair this up. And what you are looking at, you're going to see, is very biblical. Isaiah chapter 59. I'm going to read verses 5, 6, and 7. They hatch cockatrice eggs and weave the spider's web. He that eateth of their eggs dieth. That which is crushed breaketh out into a viper. The web shall not become garments, neither shall they cover themselves with their works. Their works are works of iniquity. The act of violence is in their hands. Now, this is... This is that spider's web that they weave that you are looking at right here. So I'm gonna pull back again so that you can get a look at what you're looking at. Now this is actually a lot of geometry going down right before your eyes. And it's also, like I said, it's a fractal. It's a fractal of information. But I've given this information some number value. All right, and we're going to explain that. But, man, all in all, what you are really looking at is a system for control. And the control is, of course, over us. And it's really, it's the world reality construct, okay? Everything that I've been sharing with you in this series is really encoded into this mathematical equation. Now, how did I come up with this equation? Um, I just came up with it. I just one night had it something just came to me that there is a war that goes on between the predeterminate condition and that of free will. And I just think about that so deeply that this equation is the result of this understanding of how our free will is always influenced by the predeterminate condition. That pre-influence of the predeterminate condition is what is setting the tone for the next stage of society, all right? The direction in which society is gonna travel, the direction in which the world system is gonna travel, and then as a result, the direction in which the world reality travels. Okay, and this equation is going to kind of cover that and show you, show you that. Now, when I did this, I didn't know what it was going to look like. I didn't even know that I was actually drawing something that was going to resemble a spider's web. And it's just, I just have to be completely honest, it is pretty interesting. It really is. It blows me away, as always, how in-depth this information is that... You know, I guess I'm seeing. So I'm going to start right now kind of explaining what you're looking at. And then I'm going to come back with another video and show you a little bit more. And hopefully, just be close attention here, and this should make perfect sense when we get done. All right, the apple is the beginning. This is the Garden of Eden event. Okay.